our respected chairman, our wonderful chief guest, Dr. Budwe, who the whole world admires for the amount of work which has happened at Tata Cancer. Our uh, guest of honor, the beautiful Manisha Koirala, who's beautiful inside and out. Uh, I've read, heard, and admired the amount of work she's doing, not only in the film industry, but for people who need help. Thank you so much for being here with us. Dr. Trivedi, uh, Dr. Shetty, members of the oncology team, uh, Anupam, the whole uh, Apollo team, it's a warm welcome to all of you too because it's a pledge to take on the good work which has been happening over the past uh, 34 years and to bring it to the people, not only to the people of Maharashtra, but to the rest of the world too. And of course, for our esteemed guests, well-wishers, uh, senior doctors in the gathering, I can only say thank you for being part of the Apollo family today and always because if not for the support of all of you, I don't think uh, Apollo could have really taken on this journey, taken on this extremely daring journey, and tried to see what can we do to make uh, healthcare a better landscape for the rest of India and for the rest of the world. When we started, it was started with Chairman's dream to just do something for a patient's family who could not go abroad, and it was for cardiac care. But at that time, we realized that it's not only cardiac care which we need to bring to this part of the world, but there's so much more to be done. So Apollo grew as a multi-speciality hospital in Chennai, but as it did, there were many other Apollos which came throughout the country. But today, Apollo is a healthcare ecosystem. And as our chairman has been telling us of late, he said, see to it that people don't get into hospitals. You know, keep them well, keep them outside the hospitals, detect disease early because the burden of disease is so huge, it's devastating, and that should be the commitment of the entire Apollo family. So I stand here to just be part of our chairman's vision and say that whatever we can do to help fight this disease, we will do it, but we will do it at an early stage by spreading awareness, by detecting cancer early, so that it can actually be conquerable. Uh, cancer can be conquerable, it can be cured, we have to find it early. But unfortunately, if cancer has to be treated, then we should be the best place for people to come in. So we have not compromised in any of the aspects of cancer treatment, early detection, precise, intervention, uh, great surgical team with the robots which will you know, be part of the armament soon, uh, the best radiation oncology available anywhere in the world, and of course, after that, the rehab and the aftercare. Uh, we have a, a wonderful nursing team who truly believe in delivering service with tender loving care, TLC, which is the Apollo Mantra. But while I talk about the nursing team, I will never forget the rest of the, uh, the other teams who really make it a holistic, caring environment. So I think uh, Apollo today, we're proud to launch this facility. And while we do that, we, if we stand committed to bringing health care of the highest standards. And today, I don't think I should even say world class because the team has clearly been told that we must raise the benchmark and be beyond world class. So I think that is what we would like to do today with uh, the blessings of everyone. Dr. Badwe, uh, your institution and you personally have been a great inspiration for all of us because I'm not a doctor, but every time I speak to our senior oncologist, to the team, it's always the work which is being done at Tata Cancer, which is like a benchmark. It's the spirit of the way things are being done, the true spirit of service which comes across. And we are hoping that uh, you will be, as an institution and personally a friend of Apollo, and that we will be able to emulate the good work which is happening in your institution and be able to work hand in hand for research. Because we all know and understand 
that there is not enough research. You know, whatever we do is still not enough to fight this disease. And if institutions can come together and collaborate to do research so that uh, mankind can benefit, I think we're best positioned to do it because some of the greatest learnings have come from our country. Some of the best, alter the best alternate systems are in our country. So why not treatment and clinical processes by working together and research so that the rest of the world can learn from India? And it's possible. Uh, thank you all for being here today. Uh, we would like a little prayer from you for this institution to do well and for our patients to get better. So please keep us in your thoughts and in your prayers, and I hope that uh, we can deliver on all the promises we make. Thank you again and namaste.